China's latest weapon against Taiwan, the sand dredger. What's up everyone, I'm Dredd, this article is courtesy of Reuters, let's hop into the details. On board a Taiwanese Coast Guard ship in the East China Sea, Taiwanese Coast Guard Commander Lin Chi Ming is on the front line of a new type of battle that China is waging against Taiwan. China's weapon? Sand. Lin was on the lookout for Chinese sand dredging ships encroaching on waters controlled by Taiwan. Taiwanese officials say the Chinese goal is to pressure Taiwan by tying down the island democracy's naval defenses and undermining the livelihoods of Matsu residents. Half an hour into the patrol, Lin's crew spotted two 3,000-ton dredgers dwarfing their 100-ton vessel. Parked just outside Taiwan's waters, neither of the dredgers clearly displayed their names, making it difficult for a crew member to identify them as he peered through binoculars. Upon spotting Lin's boat, the dredgers quickly pulled up anchor and headed back toward the Chinese coast. They think this area is part of China's territory, said Lin, referring to Chinese dredgers that have been intruding into Matsu's waters. They usually leave after we drive them away, but they come back again after we go away, Lin said. Chinese dredgers have been swarming around the Matsu Islands, dropping anchor and scooping up vast amounts of sand for construction projects in China. Besides Matsu, the Coast Guard says China has also been dredging in the shallow waters near the median line of the Taiwan Strait, which has long served as an unofficial buffer separating China and Taiwan. Last year, Taiwan expelled nearly 4,000 Chinese sand dredgers and sand transporting vessels from waters under its control, most of them in the area close to the median line. That's a 560% jump over the 600 Chinese vessels that were repelled in all of 2019. Thank you for watching this video. If you found it informative, please consider giving the channel a subscribe.